channel and of course today we are going to look at part two of my H&M Unconscious collection. Unconscious collection. So of course as usual we'll be looking at fast fashion side versus well fast fashion slash conscious collection versus slow fashion and pieces from my closet. As usual, we'll be looking at fabric, fit, and style. So, let's do this, guys. My first H&M piece is this gorgeous chocolate wide leg. Oh my God. Wide waistband. Guys, it's a high-waisted pants. <laughs> I am absolutely in love with this piece and I've been looking, I've been searching, I've been scouring the internet just looking for the perfect high-waisted wide leg pants and I am no longer looking guys, I'm definitely off the market with this piece this is absolutely stunning and I'm pairing it with a piece from my closet you guys must have seen it from last time I love that top it's a hundred percent cotton love the neckline that scallop detail guys absolutely love it and of course this piece comes with a belt oh the bag is thrifted a hundred percent leather this pants it's everything i've been looking for because it's very loose fitting it's very versatile and this is what i mean by its versatility you can definitely casualize it and here you could see me pairing it with the first top from the two piece that i showed you in part one of this video this for me is a perfect vacation piece because I can wear this to dinner and I can casualize it. It goes with strapless tops, absolutely gorgeous. And the material for the, these two pieces is 100% viscose, natural fiber made from wood cellulose fiber. Love it. My closet piece is this piece, guys. And yeah. I know that it looks similar but it's not and as I've mentioned I've been looking for a brown high-waisted pants because brown is my second favorite color I've always loved brown this piece I've had it for over 18 years now guys and I really really wanted another brown high-waisted pants just to compliment it because I've been wearing it to death. I've worn this so much that I wanted another piece to interchange. So I think that brown H&M pants would be a definite added value to my wardrobe. I do still love this piece and I would never get rid of it because it has such gorgeous details. I just love those buttons coming down there. Ah, I love the interesting detail. And this is a piece that just sucks you in. It really, really brings your shape together. And I really love that. But this is a piece that is very suitable for fall. And while I do take my chances wearing it in the summer, it's made from 60% polyester. 30% rayon and 5% elastin. Guys, I'm serious. That's all they gave me. I know it doesn't add up, but that's what they gave me. So that's what I'm telling you. <laughs> and oh, look at that detail. It has string details at the back. And this piece, I know I would never fall out of love with it. But at the same time, I'm really not ready for it to go. So that is why I've been looking for this brown, other brown piece. 
and I am so happy I found it. Love it. The top I'm pairing it with is a piece from a French brand, Lamedy, and it's 100% polyester. While I hate the fabric, I do love the style because of all the frills details. So love it. This is a piece I got from Zara two or three seasons ago and it's when I was channeling Julia Roberts so it is yeah it's still in my closet it's not going anywhere I love this piece because while it is a great piece it is more casual for me so it's a casual Friday's look so my wardrobe could definitely benefit from that extra wide leg chocolate pants there was definitely a gap in it sorry to interrupt guys but just a quick note hi guys if you just so happen to just click on my video you are new please click the red subscribe button so here they are guys if you click on these buttons you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when i post new videos and most importantly guys it's free thank you so much for subscribing love ya let's get back to the video the next h&m piece is this dress it's this paisley blue and white pleated dress that i absolutely stared at for at least a couple seconds and i stared in admiration because i love the print i love paisley i love blue on me as well and this is definitely a great combo but i got it all wrong fabric wise i immediately bought this because i thought it was a hundred percent viscose only viscose was the very first material i saw when i saw this dress online so i just clicked buy and it was the last one and it was on sale so i was so excited to get it but it's a hundred percent polyester outer shell and a hundred percent viscose inner shell so disappointed my closet piece is a piece from Zaffo that I fell in love with when I saw it and I was really really excited when I got it. Oh my god, guess what? It turns out to be 100% polyester but it doesn't feel that way, it doesn't move that way. But it could be one of the many tricks of polyester. Actually it wrinkles and polyester rarely wrinkles so I'm surprised. But I love it. The second piece is a piece from Zara. And I got this a couple seasons ago as well. This is not paisley. This is floral. But it has the same color scheme. It's in the same color family. And because of that, I find similarity with these two pieces. At the same time, they are not pleated. So it doesn't give me the same effect. So yeah, that's my struggle right now. This piece is 100% polyester. So my final thoughts, do I prefer my closet pieces? Yes, I love most of my closet pieces and I love the high-waisted brown pants. I don't really love the dress so much, but I have to keep it because I would lose money if I return it. H&M, well, kudos to you, great job. So definitely hope I'll see you on the sustainable side. <laughs> so if you enjoy this video guys, please leave a comment below. Give me a thumbs up. Let me know what your thoughts are on H&M Conscious or Unconscious Collection. <laughs> Catch you later guys and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.